If you're thinking about moving to the state of Michigan, you're in luck because I've compiled my top five things about living in Michigan that I've heard from other people and that I agree with. And we're starting now. All right, so if you're new here and new to me, my name is Paul and I help people like you make better decisions when moving to, from, or around the state of Michigan. So if you like that sort of thing, check out some of the other videos on my channel because I've made a whole bunch of them. And if you wanna make a move in the state of Michigan or to Michigan in the next three days or three years, reach out because I can probably help you. I'm a full-time real estate agent and I've been doing it for a very long time. All right, so number one on our list is the people in Michigan. Hands down, the number one thing that I hear from people moving from other states to Michigan is that the people in Michigan are super, super nice. Now they're almost too nice. If you don't believe me, get in your car, drive to any random suburb in Metro Detroit, park your car, take a walk around for a little bit, stop the first neighbor you see, and ask them a question. They'll tell you all sorts of things. They'll probably invite you over for dinner. One person I'm helping buy a house did just that, and the person they met offered to sell them their house. Mi casa is su casa. That's a true story. It doesn't get much crazier than that. So the people in Michigan are super nice, maybe too nice. The next best thing about living in the state of Michigan is the cities. Michigan is a state of cities, not neighborhoods. I mean, we have neighborhoods, but it's just a little bit different. So when people say that they're moving to Detroit, they're actually not. They're going to be moving to a city outside of Detroit, not a city within Detroit. If you look at areas like Dallas, Texas, you can live in a neighborhood in Dallas, Texas, that's about the size of a city around Detroit. I think it makes way more sense to just have them their individual cities instead of just being all in one city, like saying, like, I'm from Detroit. I'm not from Detroit. I'm from Metro Detroit. I'm a Metro Detroiter. The next best thing about living in the state of Michigan is the outdoor lifestyle. We have a beautiful landscape, beautiful climate, and Michigan's known for being a paradise for outdoor enthusiasts. Hikers, they'll have over 13,000 miles of state designated trails and hike paths. Hike paths, path pathways, hiking trails. All right, you can go run them. That's a whole bunch of ultra marathons. How many ultra marathons could you do with 13,000 miles? I don't know, get a calculator. We don't have time for that. And if you're a fisherman, you can just keep your rod, reel, and tackle box in your car, just pull over and fish. Where, um, uh, I don't think that's actually allowed, but you, know, you could do it. Thanks for the legal advice. In Michigan, you're never more than six miles away from a body of water or 85 miles away from a great lake. Lots of places to hide. That's true. Use that in trivial pursuit. The next best thing about living in the state of Michigan is the lakes. Michigan actually gets its name from the Indian word Michigama, which literally means Big lake, not big lake, large lake. Tomatoes, tomatoes. Potatoes, potatoes. Okay, well no one says that. Just look at Michigan on the map. It's a water wonderland. We have over 3,288 miles of shoreline. We're only number two to Alaska, because it's Alaska. We have well over 11,000 inland lakes here. So if you wanna buy a house on a lake, Michigan is probably your spot. If you wanna buy a house on a lake and use me as your agent, I promise I won't just show up randomly to hang out on your boat. Oh, thank God. But I won't say no to an invite. The next best thing about living in the state of Michigan is the seasons. Is that a good thing? No, a lot of people complain about the snow and stuff, but we have actual seasons here. We don't have 365 days of the same stuff every day. It's not all sunshine and rainbows every day. We have some variation. Some people take this as a negative and they want to leave and like move to Florida, which I think is a terrible idea. Summer is hot, fall is like cool, spring is like crisp. When I say summer's hot, summer's like walking on the frickin' sun. It's really hot. It's like Arizona hot, sort of. I grew up here in Michigan and I cannot imagine having a winter without snow. If you have, let me know what it's like. I mean, don't just say like, it's awesome but like, doesn't it get old? If you wanna make Michigan your home, reach out, let me know. And if you're still looking for a place to live in Michigan, check out some of these other videos and playlists around here, and I'll see you there.